This is the JVSN Media Network broadcasting worldwide. Thank you very much, Jenna Green. Good day, YouTube viewers. Jeff here with you. It is great to be back with you here in the JBSN Sports Cards and Autographs YouTube channel once again. Thank you for stopping by on your YouTube journey. If you're brand new to the channel, I welcome you board. Appreciate the opportunity. If you're turning back to the channel once again, I appreciate you returning. As you can see in today's video, my friends, for the first time on our channel, we're going to be taking a look at the brand new 2022 Panini Select Football Cards here. We have a blaster box to open up here for you today. Trevor Lawrence from the Jacksonville Jaguars is on the cover of the box here. We have four cards per pack, six packs in all for 24 cards. We're to find three blaster exclusive red and blue prism die cut cards per box on average. You see the information up top there. This side of the box here, we are to find one silver prism die cut per box on average. We're looking for autographs as well. This side of the box here has your breakdown of the randomly inserted. It is a 300 card set with 100 base from the concourse, 100 base from the premier level, and 100 base from the club level there. We are going to be looking for zebra cards, which are short print considered case hits. We are going to be also looking for the um, all sorts of different um, die cuts there as well. We're looking, obviously, for uh, snakeskin cards as well. We'll be seeing if we can find those in the green and black. We are to be finding black cards, which are numbered to one. They are the one of ones. They are short printed as well. Non-base fall to one in every pack. We can find autographs as well. Your production date is on the bottom here, and, and we will get that for you there. It is from May of 2023. This just came out to the market. You see that side of the box right there. And let's just go ahead and go for it here. So we're going to go ahead and crack this open and see what we can uncover in this box. Let me give the March of Dimes duck a little squeeze here on the box. Hopefully... That will lead us to some luck here today. So let's go ahead and open it. I do appreciate you all stopping by the channel once again here today. Check this out. We very much appreciate it. And we'll put that over there. Let's go ahead and get the box open. So it's been seeing quite a few of these open on YouTube. I've uh, been seeing some nice pulls so far. And hopefully we'll have a nice pull waiting for us here. So there are six packs. We'll set up two piles here with three packs to a pile. Let's close the box up and put it over here in the corner. Of course, as you all know, we're looking for the big hits here today. We're looking to get to the winner's circle and hopefully find an autograph or some sort of a case hit. Wish me luck, everybody. I have all my supplies on hand, including one touch in case we hit that one of one or something significant. Let's go for it. So we'll go ahead and get a good look at the design here. And it starts off right there with Chris Olave there on the base rookie. Very nice. Jake Ferguson right there on the rookie. Next up, we've got a, looks like a Drake London. And it is a Drake London card right there. Let me show you what the back of these look like. So that's what the Drake London looks like. That looks like an insert of sorts. Last card we have here is Zion Johnson on the rookie. And it tells you right there, this is the premier level design right there. And then we have, we'll just look at the back of these real quick as well. The Chris Olave is a concourse, and so is the Jake Ferguson. So, little distinctive designs there, and uh, that's what we got so far there. Let's go ahead and open up the next pack. Now, I did get this one from uh, Walmart. They were running for $35. I'm, I'm assuming that Target and Meyer have uh, different parallel designs as well. So, we'll see what we have here. We've got uh, Trayvon Walker there for our next rookie. We find a lot of rookies here early on. That's going to be a concourse. We got uh, Khalil Shakir right there on the rookie. That's going to be a concourse. We got our first die cut. This is going to be of Andrew Booth Jr. right there on the red and blue uh, die cut there. And behind him we got uh, Mr. Taylor right there. Let me show you the back of the die cut. And that's the premier level, of course. And then you see the uh, you know, the uh, Taylor card there from the Saints. There. That, of course, is a uh, premier level as well. Let's continue. So, overall, uh, obviously, we're going to be looking for those number cards. We're going to be looking, of course, for the zebras and the black one of ones, autographs, all that good stuff, like I mentioned. There's a Monron Say Brown right there. I think that's one of our first non rookies right there. So, we'll put that over here. We've got a uh, nice card here. This is going to be a uh, Josh Pascal on the green. That's cool right there. Not too bad. Let's look at the back of that. And that is a number card, by the way. Let's uh, get that in on camera as I bump the camera, of course. That is number 22 out of 299 there on the Josh Pascal. So that is a, a number card. Very nice right there. And then I like this next card right here. 
That's a good one right there. Mr. Brock Purdy right there on the uh, numbers card. Very nice. Let's go ahead and get that one sleeved up right there. Of course, Brock Purdy, one of the key rookies from the set here that we're looking for. We'll definitely take a Brock Purdy. That's pretty good right there. You see that right there. We'll put that over. And then we've got Nick Bosa right there. Nick Bosa. And that is going to be a club level card. Very nice. It's our first club level card. So overall, I'd say we're doing pretty well so far. Let's continue on. So... Yes, not too bad. Let's see if we can find a case hit. We've got Alec Pierce right there on the next card right there. Your next rookie that's on the base. We got Kobe Bryant right there on the uh, base design. Malik Willis, nice, right there on the uh, bl blue and red die cut right there. Not too bad. And then DJ Moore right there on the base. So, pretty good stuff here overall. We have two packs left. Let's continue. So... Yes, I could see why people enjoy this stuff. There's a lot of good stuff here. There is uh, Cameron Dicker right there on the base rookie design. And then we've got uh, Lamar Jackson right there. And then um, David Ajabo right there on the red and blue uh, die cut. And then we have Terry McLaurin right there, Scary Terry. And that is the premier level card right there. We'll put that um, over here. Final pack of the break, folks. Again, thank you so much for checking us out. We very much appreciate it. Let's see if we can finish with something big here. So, Jaquan Brisker on the base right there starts it off. Derek Carr right there on the base. We got a Futures card there. Jamison Williams right there. Very nice. Nice select Future card there. And our last card is going to be a Rashad Bayman die cut. This is going to be the uh, silver die cut prism right there. So, that is going to be our silver. I'll show you the back of that. And that is uh, the Concourse, which is the base version. So... But it is the silver, so not too bad right there. So overall, I'd say we did pretty well. Let's go ahead and very quickly recap what we got here before we head on out. We'll show you the red and blue die cuts again here. There's the David Ajabo right there. And then we had the uh, Malik Willis and Andrew Booth, so not too bad right there. Definitely take that. And then we hit the, uh, the numbered green here for uh, Josh Pascal right there. We'll show you that again. We'll show you the numbering. On the concourse, number 22 out of 299. And um, and let's pretty much end it with the, um, I'd say the big pool of the break here was the uh, Brock Purdy. We did find a Brock Purdy there on the numbers insert rookie right there. So very nice overall. Let me know in the comments section below if you've opened the new select football from Panini and what your biggest pulls are. I'd love to read them in the comments section below. Be sure to keep your eyes on the channel for more breaks coming up. We have more football cards up along with baseball, basketball, wrestling, and much, much more. So be sure to keep your eyes on the channel for all that coming up. Thanks for checking out this Blast Box break of 2022 Panini Select NFL Training Cards. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you enjoyed this, please be sure to leave a like on the video, sub to the channel, hit the bell for future video notifications, and be sure to check out all my other football breaks on the YouTube channel. We'll see you the next time in the next break. Bye for now, everyone. For the JBSN Media Network, this is Jenna Green speaking.